is a technique in the sewing advisor for overcast and hem. That is technique number three. Now, depending on the fabric, we're going to work on a little stretchy fabric. How about a stretch medium here? And it will take me to their exact stitch and tell me what foot to put on. Sometimes it'll be the B foot, which it is for the stretch fabric, but sometimes it'll be the J foot, which has got a little pin in here, kind of a one toe. This is great because the stitches form right over that pin and help it from like curling under. Love that stitch. But let me just try, we're going to do this as a kind of like a construction hem. Now, if you find yourself with a serger, oftentimes I recommend going to the serger to doing this. But I'm going to just cut out like a little necklace line here and I've got some ribbing I'm going to fold in half long ways and line up all three raw edges the ribbing and the cut edge so this stitch is going to actually create a seam because it's got straight parts to it and an overcast and that's the little stitches that you see that will be going out to the right side now how I guide this I'm going to guide it right along the inside of the right toe once you take a few stitches you pretty much want to make sure that as you sew you want the needle going all the way out to the far right edge and then going off the fabric that's the best for it because then it really encases it so I'm going to stretch the little bit of ribbing here as we go ribbing is usually cut smaller than the opening so that's what makes the whole entire hole kind of squeeze together where around a neckline or around sleeves and it makes it nice and comfortable there so I'm just kind of winging it and we'll just go ahead and stitch all the way through and show you the stitch so once you use the sewing advisor, and of course because I did, and said I was working on a stretch medium fabric, it also adjusted the pressure of the foot. So I didn't have to worry about any fabric kind of waving on me or not getting properly stretched. Um, so here we have a nice, and the stitch is gonna be a, a one that will give. So it is a stretch stitch, it's an overlock stitch, and it's a seam all in one pass. Isn't that beautiful?